Despite voicing more confidence months ago, President Biden's campaign chair making waves tonight, saying Florida is not a battleground for them this November. Tonight's in Tampa Bay's Aaron Parsegian sitting down with a Senate candidate who thinks otherwise. I think this is going to be the year to start changing things around here for Florida families. We caught up with Debbie Mukarsel Powell during a stop in Tampa. The former one term congresswoman is among four Democrats vying for a primary win in August to likely take on Republican Senator Rick Scott in November. And despite huge gains for Republicans in the Sunshine State, DMP, as she's called, still thinks it's a winnable matchup, urging voters to be engaged. In 2022, there was a lot of apathy. People stayed home. A lot of our voters did not come out. I think this is going to be a completely different cycle. Rick Scott is well known in the state, but he's extremely unpopular. Senator Scott calls his likely competitor extreme, pointing the finger at her with posts on X, saying her policies helped accelerate inflation and the border crisis. I'm tired of the division, of the chaos. We need someone that's going to sit down and try to find solutions to very serious challenges. During our conversation, the mom, an Ecuadorian immigrant, pitched herself as a unifier who says if elected, she would take those dinner table issues to the Senate with proposals to tackle the rising cost of living and property insurance. And there's a bill in the House that doesn't have a Senate companion that could actually reduce the price of property insurance rates by 25 percent. Um, we need to invest also in building resilient homes, businesses. She also says she'll fight to protect health care for all Floridians and supports an amendment on the ballot in November that would enshrine abortion rights in the state, saying it's Senator Scott who holds the extreme stance. To make that choice independent of politicians like Rick Scott, independent of government interference, it's central to the health care of a woman. It's central to our dignity and to the safety. In Tampa, Aaron Parsegian, 10 Tampa Bay. We also went more in depth on issues like the southern border crisis and the Israel Hamas war. You can see her responses on our free 10 Tampa Bay app.